Welcome to my channel, exploring old technologies and seeing new ideas. Let's begin. Interesting outcome of working with printer motors and LEDs and AC that I thought I'd share. My backyard windmill broke uh, a number of years ago because of high wind, and the, when the bearing went, it took out the ring magnet. So I decided I'd take it apart just to see what was inside of it now that I'm looking at motors. And I repaired the ring magnet by using some super glue to glue it back on the shaft. That was a bit of a long shot. And I found that the bearing that was broken was a skateboard bearing, so I went out and got one of those. The real mystery came when I was trying to look at the LEDs. It turns out that they're going to get certain groups of them to work when I fired them up on DC in parallel. Uh, trying to get further to the bottom of it, I connected them up to the motor and found that it was the same situation. Only certain ones would light up. And I checked the output, and the output is actually about plus or minus two volts for round zero. Uh, it's a square wave, interesting enough. So I wired the blue one in reverse because it was the heaviest load. Of, and interesting enough, it took the, the downside of the AC waveform, and the other two took the upside, and it worked beautifully. All LEDs lit up, so I wired her up, uh, put her back together, and I now have a garden fan fixed up and a little bit more insight into how LEDs work on AC. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll be looking forward to preparing another one for you soon.